The aerospace industry is part of day-to-day -day life and involves really innovative technologies. Here at the AMRC, Kenametal are showcasing their innovative tooling with complex demos. It's important to us so that we do reach the customer and it's important for the customer to see the latest technologies. I mean, what we're demonstrating today is, is, is something different. You know, we, we're looking at Blisk manufacture today and we're looking to do it differently. And, you know, our claim to fame is we're going to do this a lot quicker than the traditional methods. And that's what we hopefully we show the guys who are here today, our customers from around the industry. We show them the value of, of working with Kenner Metal and what we can provide, which is an added value. They'll see Kenner Metal in action, they'll see the tools in action, and it gives the customer a chance to see firsthand. You know, you can talk about it and everything else, but seeing it, it's different. In Canon Metal, the role of the service engineering department is to um, solve um, customer challenges. They are more and more complex over the days. And uh, through technical, detailed solutions, we are able to face this challenging and answer our customer need. To overcome customer challenges, we defining fine-tuned custom solution tool, optimize processes for them, and for sure, be on site in front of the machine to answer on a long-term solution. Some really big crowds forming behind me to take a look at the demos being performed on these CNC machines. Kenner Metal are putting their tools to the test with Inconel and Titanium. Kenner Metal joined the AMRC 10 years ago and became a tier two member and upgraded to a tier one membership like eight years ago. And since then, I work very close with the AMRC. We have given research work here to the AMRC, so they help us to develop product. They help us to develop processes. So the demonstration we showed today were two parts. One of them, the first part was a titanium structure component where we applied uh, indexable rough milling with an Harvey Ultra 8X cutter. The second uh, demo was uh, an INCO 718 BLISC or IBR um, where the roughing processes have been applied with a new method with high-speed ceramic milling. So we have here two examples of these demo cutters with high-speed ceramic milling. Reaction of customer was it's a disruptive technology. It completely changes the workload for some of the customers when roughing is reduced to a very short cycle time versus long milling uh, times. And the more milling time will be in the future in the finishing to the end contour, but the roughing has been reduced massively. And with the shorter cycle time, the high machine tool hourly rates become less problematic and you have higher productivity out of your cell, you can sell more components. I think I agree with you. I think that it's important to show to the customer that our tools are ready for the real production, okay? So using a component that our customer are machining every day for sure can be more attractive and we can directly send a message that our tools are ready for the shop floor, not just for the demo. So the event we have today at MRC, together with Kenametal, Eller, Siemens and Third Wave was very good from our point of view, mainly for the customer, because the customer were able to see something very interesting on the presentation in the morning and uh, partially in the afternoon, but then we link uh, the theory with the practice. We went on the machines, we saw real chips uh, and we, we showcase also different way to machine, for example, inconel material using ceramic. What I think uh, they learned something more specific about softwares. Uh, very interesting was the third wave uh, presentation because more simulation on the behavior of the material can really make them to rethink about the, the milling process itself and maybe they can value add at the end of the, the application. Thank you.